Honey, you had him all night. Sha is crying for her new boyfriend. She was <laughs> was laughing at her all night. She was in full blown raging heat. Um, so she got to be with the boys last night. Little Peter Pepper, I don't think, is showing much signs of being able to complete the job. So more than likely, it'll be a fluff and utter baby, which is awesome. And we can't wait. So we're going to be looking at a... I got to plug my date into my calculator, but I'm thinking February, baby. I'm just making a quick unedited video. I'm just going to throw this up on YouTube when I got it done filming because I don't have time to edit. I have too much I have to do because we're getting ready to go out of town for my sister's wedding. And I am so excited to share this special time with my family. We have continued to have a severe heat wave and drought in Georgia. So there's been no fall seeds sown yet because it would be dangerous for them in this extreme heat and temperature range. So by the time I get back from Massachusetts, I'll be bringing the Massachusetts weather with me and we'll be able to get those seeds in the ground and have some wonderful fall veggies to look forward to. I really do love this time of year. It's so much fun to see who's going to get bred with which buck and who's going to be do when and what fall veggies I can get in the ground. It's really a beautiful rejuvenating time for me. Um, the temperature starts to cool down. I'm able to do more outside. It doesn't affect me as much. So right now it is almost 90 degrees already and it's going to get even hotter. It's in the high 90s all this week. But it looks like when we come back from Massachusetts, we're going to drop down into the 80s finally which still isn't cool, but it's cooler than the 90s. So we're looking forward to that as well. The whole family is definitely feeling the fall vibes. The boys already took out all the Halloween decorations and the fall decorations and put them all up in the front yard and around the house. And this weekend, my eldest, my daughter Vivian, she's 20, and my son Dalton, who's 18, said, let's have a bonfire and... So we did. So we had a full moon bonfire and we had a lovely surprise when we were done roasting our hot dogs. Ryan said, all right, everybody, hold on just a second. I'll be right back. And we heard the tractor fire up and he came driving over to the fire on the tractor and he was pulling a trailer with hay bales. He had a hay ride set up for us. He had a a mowed a strip around the edge of the property where he could pull the trailer and us on the hayride and we had the best time ever. All right, I hope that was enough of an update for you guys. I just wanted to make sure I have at least one video out a week. Hopefully, um, as I start to feel better, I'll have more videos out more frequently. But I just wanted to give you this quick unedited, quick grab my phone and film so that you guys will have something for this week because it's going to be a very busy rest of the week for me. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful week, and I look forward to seeing you soon.